Okay, uh, now we're talking about the image quality uh, with the Canon 40D and how to select that. Um, there are lots of different factors to consider when you're setting up the image quality. Um, obviously, the higher the quality of the image, the larger those files are going to be and the uh, fewer uh, shots you're actually going to be able to take. Um, but, on the other hand, you might want to have a really high quality shot and know that you're only going to take a few in that case. Uh, you're definitely going to want to shoot in uh, RAW mode or high quality JPEG mode or maybe both at the same time. Uh, to set the uh, quality of your images, what you're going to do is press the menu button on the uh, top left side of your 40D and then use the main dial to scroll through all of your options. Right now we're in a uh, advanced shooting mode. We're in um, this mode so that we have more options. And what I'm going to do is in the first menu here, scroll down to the quality submenu. Uh, it's at, actually at the very top. And then just select that. Press set on the um, quick control dial. <clears throat> and then we have uh, all these options in the quality menu here. Um, these are all JPEG settings, and um, at the top of the screen on the right side here, you have a couple of things. One, you have the dimensions of the picture that you're going to take, and then right next to it in uh, a bracket is a number which indicates how many pictures can be taken in that mode. Um, so as we scroll down here, uh, we notice, let's see, Actually, I'm going to scroll this way. Starting with that uh, high-quality JPEG, we have 876 photos. Now we have 999 photos. Um, and then when we start adding uh, camera raw, this, this setting actually is raw plus high-quality JPEG. It records two images at the same time, both of the same dimension. Um, and then if we, uh, if we scroll all the way to the end here, we can uh, just record uh, a single file image, a raw image, or a smaller, what's called SRAW, which is uh, it's the same uh, raw da data from the camera, but it's a little bit smaller file. Um, camera raw is a good, uh, good file to, uh, quality to, to shoot in because it gives you a lot of options in post when you're uh, processing the images. Um, it just saves the original data that was captured to the sensor. Um, but you might, uh, you might want to shoot a few more pictures than uh, 200 on a 400 gig card. And in that case, it'd probably be, go ahead and, you know, it might be better to just select a little bit lower quality image. Um, what I'm going to do is go ahead and just stick with a high quality JPEG. 876 photos is enough for me. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and press set. And then to uh, exit from this menu, I'm going to press menu. And then uh, I'm ready to start shooting.